yesterday I did my chimney and the fireplace. This part here, I just put a, a board in the back, a little board in the back of this one, so I have a little gap here, and then I'm going to fill this up with grout right up to the to sides, and this part here, I think, is going to be hidden with the roof, and this is what my fireplace looks like from the window. Not bad, huh? And I didn't really use a plan for that. I just went with the height, and and I went. Uh, I had to go on one side because of the the top of the roof here. So I just went right against the the center, and I made it about as much as reality for size and scale wise. And in there I got two boards to make it thicker so the hole would be a little bit deep and I'm just going to probably paint that black in the back there and then I'm going to have some rocks all over that with grout. Alright the chimney is almost done. My lovely assistant, Nancy, my wife, is doing all the masonry for me. She's the artistic one. Oh, can you do that again, Nancy? She got the artistic hands. And right now, she's doing the back of the chimney. And she painted the, the board black. And then applied some glue, and now she's putting all these, these rocks. This is how she's doing it. And and then when she's done the backboard, she's going to do the sides here. And at the end, the top of the chimney. So after that, it's going to be time to put the roof on. chimney is almost done. The only thing left is the top part. We're going to put some rocks on the top of the, the chimney. And all around in the back, the sides, everything is done. As you can see. Well, so this is the mise à jour of my log cabin, the update of my log cabin. I'm ready to put the roof on. I started putting the first part of the roof, which is going to be the front, the front porch or patio, whatever you call it. So this will be the trou for the chimney, the hole for the chimney. And now I'm going to finish this tomorrow. I got to put these hinges on because I'm going to have one part of the roof attached and the other one I'm going to lift it up. Hello, Lamey! So when I want to go inside, well, I'm just going to go here on this one. And I'm just going to lift, lift it up on this side. And then you'll have the surprise later of all the little things we're going to have in there. And hopefully we're going to have birds staying in here for the winter. For the front patio, this is the tour for the 
le petit patio en avant. Puis je vais mettre des beams là, pour supporter ça. Puis là, j'ai tout attaché ça sur une feuille de plywood. I attach all that on a plywood sheet, so when it's done, that's how I'm going to lift it and bring it in the back. I'm actually doing the roof. Well, I've done the roof. J'ai fait le, le toit. Et là, je n'étais pas sûr si j'allais mettre du bardeau ou du, uh, du vrai shingle là, pour les toits. Là. So, I don't know if I was going to do a wood shingles or the real shingles. So, I think I'm going to go with this one. I had a few pieces. So now, this here is going to be the opening part. Wow, this project is a lot longer than I was hoping it to be. Well, it's my fault. Woody shingles. Je prends des vrais morceaux de shingles, puis je les coupe tout dans ce carré, là. ça va prendre forever. Bon, on a fait la finition hier soir. Travailler là-dessus jusqu'à 11h, mon pénalité. J'ai fait mon petit patio en avant. Puis ma porte. Tout peinturé ça. Avec les shutters, on a peinturé. I didn't put hinges on my shutters because when I did it on the door, it was really tough to get those little tiny screws in there. So I just nailed it with my finishing nailer, all the shutters around. C'est trop beau pour les oiseaux. Ah, oh, déménage tu Nancy? Avec le beau petit arbre de Noël. Nancy even put some little Christmas socks on the fireplace. Des petits bois de Noël même sur la, la fireplace. Puis on a mis du cushion floor. C'est au billet de montrer ça. Yeah. 